All right, my first vegan pizza. It's been in the oven. It was on 350. I turned it off a few minutes ago. Oh man, no, that's not good. That is not good. You don't want to do that. Let's see what happened here. Bingo. Beautiful. Oh my. Yeah, so I'm going to put a link down there for the beginning when I prepped it. And I just put it in right before I heated it up. So it's been in so far about, actually about 45 minutes. I put it on 350. I put it on lower than the normal because it's kind of thick. I saw it kind of swelled up a little bit. It looks good. Um, like I said, I got uh, everything vegan on here. So... Um, Black bean soup is what I based it with. I didn't have any um, tomato sauce, but I did use sun-dried tomatoes, some baby spinach, some red, orange, yellow, peppers, green peppers, mushroom, pineapple, cheese, all vegan. Um, I used some black seed, some pink sea salt, and some, some type of vegetable vegan seasoning. So this is my first attempt at pizza, man, inspired by Will, Potato Strong. Been watching him hook up the pizzas and things, and... It's been making me hungry, so I'm going to set up my little, you know me, I don't, I can't really, uh, I don't really edit in things like that. I'm going to set this up. Bear with me for a second. So we have the pizza, and you know you're supposed to let the pizza sit for a little while before you cut it, I guess. I guess that's a rule. I don't know. I don't know if that's a rule or not. But uh, this is my first pizza. I'm going to go ahead and dig in. Doing it with one hand is not easy. Oh yeah, I guess maybe you want to let it sit for a little bit for the crust. But like I said, my first one, we keep stuff raw and real here. Unedit it. Let's see if I can get this ah uh, okay get this off of here let's see that texture take a bite 